I'm Al Pearson, the current leader of the Guy Lombardo Orchestra. It's a real pleasure for me to carry on the music of Guy Lombardo, who introduced more popular songs to us than any other band leader in history. Old Lang Syne is, of course, his most famous, but together with his brothers, he performed more than 500 hits that have become a remarkable and delightful part of romance and music in our time. These are the songs that you're going to be enjoying again or discovering for the first time as you join us in the next half hour and throughout this series. Experience now the original Royal Canadians performing the sweetest music this side of heaven, led by the one and only Guy Lombardo. As most of you probably know, our band is sort of a family affair. I want you to meet my brothers. At the far end of the sax section, playing baritone sax, is my brother Victor. And in the back row, playing first trumpet, is another brother, Liebert. And directly in front of Liebert and in the first row is my brother Carmen, who plays first sax. You know, Carmen's written a lot of songs that I'm sure you're familiar with. He wrote... Little Coquette, Sweethearts on Parade, Snuggled on Your Shoulder, Sailboat in the Moonlight, Powder Your Face with Sunshine, Seems Like Old Times. Well, we'd like to play one of his real big hits, and he's going to sing along with the trio, along with Fred Higman and Cliff Grass. The number is Boo Hoo. <laughs> Let's dance, and during this number, we're going to feature our twin pianos, Buddy Brennan and Fred Kreitzer, and on guitar, Bill Flanagan. The number, The Petite Waltz.
And now we're going to feature some of our vocalists, Kenny Gardner and the Lombardo Trio, and they do a catchy tune called Do You. You know, we're very proud of the fact that ever so many people spend their birthdays and anniversaries with us. Tonight we have as our guests, Mr. and Mrs. Edward Collins, who are celebrating their 35th wedding anniversary. They've requested Bill Flanagan to do a song for them, so Bill's going to sing from the show Arabian Nights, A Thousand and One Nights. <laughs>
thousand and one stars will guide me to a thousand and one Do you know that the musical form of the medley was introduced by Guy Lombardo? It was just a year or so earlier that Lombardos got off the bus from London, Ontario for their first gig in the U.S. Well, in the mid-twenties at the Claremont Inn in Cleveland, to satisfy all the song requests that the band was getting, the medley was born. Actually, it was the owner of the club, Louis Bleet, that came up with the idea. But Guy ran with it. You'll hear one of those Lombardo medleys soon. But next up, the popular hit, Three Little Words. And I'm sure you know what those three words are. And, of course, you recognize that as three little words. I see Karen Chandler over there, the Coral's new recording star. And while I visit Karen, I'm going to have Kenny Gardner do the story of Dangerous Dan McGill. of the boys were whooping it up at the Malamute's Cafe. And the ragtime kid at the music box was a jazz and a tune that was gay. And back of the bar in a poker game sat a man that everyone knew. He was grim and cold, he was bad and bold, he was dangerous Dan McGrew. And while dangerous Dan was a playin' in his hand and keeping his mind on his game, you could see standin' by with a gleam in her eye and her hair just as red as a flame. A gal who was tall with a face like a doll and her fingernails painted blue. Oh, a gal who was tall with a face like a doll. The lady that's known as Lou. And from out of the night, which was 50 below, and into the din and the glare, a man staggered in who was haggard and thin, and his face was filled with despair. Now he looked all around until he had found the lady that's known as Lou. And then the stranger turned and his eyes they burned on dangerous Dan McGrew. And suddenly, wham, all the lights went out. And a voice cried, die, you must. And then a woman screamed, and a shot rang out. And somebody bit the dust. And then the lights flashed on, and the Northwest Mounted Police came a crashing through. They drew their guns, and they said, oh, which one is dangerous, Dan McGrew? Somebody say it. Woo, woo, woo. 
Ooh, they're so big. And skips across the floor. One, two, skip. Hand on hip, right out through the open door. Now, was it the stranger taking his leave, or the lady that's known as Lou? It was nobody else in this whole wide world but danger, Dan Mahabrew. Well, Karen, how does it feel to have uh, two recording hits in uh, such a short space of time? Oh, it feels wonderful, Guy. You know, for about a year, I referred to my first record, Hold Me, Thrill Me, Kiss Me, as my bread and butter song, and the butter's melted a little bit, so I kind of hope this is going to put a little more butter back on the bread. <laughs> I have some news for you. It's already done it. Well, I hope so. Oh, it's wonderful. Thank you. So, now that Karen has put us in the mood, let's dance again. And tonight, your Lombardo medley consists of I'm in the Mood for Love, my Blue Heaven, and Little Coquette. We hope you'll join us again real soon for more of your favorite songs. So till we meet again, this is Guy Lombardo saying good luck, goodbye, and God bless you.
Thank you, Guy. It's an honor and a privilege to carry on the Guy Lombardo tradition. He's hearing even sweeter music now, but for us, it's good to hear, as he played it, the sweetest music this side of heaven. This is Al Pearson. Thanks for joining us. Thank you.